All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So today is Wednesday. We're playing them Raid Raptors, and uh, we're going to be discussing cheating in this video because there, there, there's some cheating going around, you know. Uh, one of the big things that was cheated upon is uh, is uh, what happened in the previous YCS, YCS uh, Prague. So, yeah, we're going to be discussing that. So, you know, summon, you know, send one Raid Raptor from your deck and then do that, so... Uh, I guess we'll just go ahead and do our classic Raider after plays. It didn't open up fantastically, but, uh, you know, we can get some plays done. You know how Raider Raptors are. It just gets hella searchy. So, I edited the deck a little bit, and hopefully we'll go ahead and actually do some actual plays, because I can't stand that I'm searching for nothing. Like, that drives, that dr shit drives me up the wall. Yeah, uh, if you're not gonna use it, lol, it's my YouTube channel. It's my YouTube Channel and I play lots of decks. Today I am playing Red Raptors. You should check it out. <laughs> you should uh, check it out. <laughs> Shameless plug. <laughs> okay. Alright. <laughs> He's like, nope. Like, alright, that's kind of rude. He could have said, no, thank you, but nope works too, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> so. Uh, we can just get hella searching, like, we already know. So, the one that I put in here is boost, so when he gets a monster, I get to go ahead and just pop him too. So it's just another card I conditionally search for, because why not? Really, because why not? So I guess I can go ahead and get fuzzy. XCU2 in two strikes and do all that. So, uh, apparently the winner of YCS Prague, and I think it's Prague, like, I don't think it's pronounced Prague, I think it's Prague, I'm not sure. But I, I just think Prague would be a better pronunciation of how it's pronounced? Like, I don't know. Uh, don't come to me for grammar. Hell no. But, uh, I'll go ahead and get me singing. So, so some singing, special summon fuzzy, and go into another one, and just plus, just plus, just play with myself and plus. Once again, didn't open up with any back row, didn't open up with any rank up, didn't open up with shit. And that's, the, that's, that's one of the problems with this deck that I'm having as late. And I don't open up with shit. Like, generally, I can at least go ahead and stall out some in this 25 booty and you know, get my plays on. Can I, I can't begin to how, say how suck to basic those plays are, but you're just my two cents. Like, I didn't open up fantastically, but uh, if you say so, I mean, I think I'm doing okay. I really do. You know, I think that I'm doing just fine. Actually, you know what? I probably should have got, uh, no, no, I'm okay. And now since I got resource out the ass, that Twin is gonna get hella use if I need, if need be. Like, he doesn't want to talk about how basic my plays are. I'm just apparently I'm a basic bitch. Like, there's Josh guy over here just being very rude. Really rude. Sure, I guess. That's fine. Just very, very rude. <laughs> oh, and you're playing Mermels with Summoner Monk? Like, hello? Like, alright, I guess. Like, what do you need Summoner Monk for? So, let's just go ahead and go with the basic plays of um, Atlantean Mermels. Uh,. So he cheated. He cheated a couple of times, you know, a couple of times, trying to get an additional normal summon and uh, just, just cheating a handful of times, I must say. So, yep. So go ahead and get your basic plays on. Yep, search that. Pop me, that's fine. And tribute him off, get an additional attack. Like, it's all good. It's all good. Now, you're a much faster, stronger deck than I am. I, did, I didn't open up that well, though. I really didn't, but I should still be okay. I really should. Yep, get another Neptibus, because it's totally what I want to see. Some more Neptibus. Tribute off to attack twice, equip, and then as soon as you attack me, I'll just boost and pop you, so it's, I'm still okay. I, I really am still okay. It's just, it, no back row, no nothing. Like, I've run so much back row and so much hate, because this deck is just so, so wow. And played fucking Sacred Sword on the Megalo. Didn't see that coming, not at all. Did not see that coming. That's not what I needed. I could I could search for this. Like this is the one I need. Like not at all, not at all. So I guess I'll go ahead and just activate, get another search. You didn't even play your equip spell. Like that that's interesting too. So I guess since I already got you, I might as well just go ahead and get another one of you, because why not? This boost is actually pretty good. And do I have anything to deal with him? Like without ranking up, I really not that powerful. Oh, I guess I can go into Utopia the Lightning. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I can just go into Utopia the Lightning, so. Go ahead and normal summon you. If you fuck me up with back row, then fuck it, I don't care either. 
Like, I got resources, so that's what really matters. Okay. That's fine. You can have that. I'm what I'm mad at. Open up Vanity? Sure. Uh, so he tried to attempt to get an additional normal summon twice. Uh, I'll put the link in the, uh, in the description. I believe it's from Glasgow. But, uh, tried to, to get an additional normal summon twice. Uh, what else did he try to do? Uh, he didn't play the Pendulum Rebirth prop. I mean, Pendulum Rising properly. I played that card once. Then I played it in DDDs. So I was like, you know, let me go ahead and see uh, how this goes down in DD. So he's going to stun me with Vanities and then attack over my ass, apparently. Sure seems like it. Sure seems like it. Like, at least it's Marksman. If it was another fucking uh, infantry, I would have got destroyed. But, you know, look at this. So sending him, drawing him. So stun me with Vanities. Get rid of the Vanities and go off during your time. Like, we already know. We've seen from yesterday's daily builds how fucking crazy Vanities is. I really don't like the idea of losing to a very rude person like him, but if it happens, it happens, I guess. So, damn. 4,000 beater. 4,000 beater, people. Uh, boost. <laughs> Just get wrecked. Just get wrecked. Just boost. <laughs> I love that. Guy. Boost? Yeah, yeah. I was like, you know, what am I searching for? Let me search for something good. Boost. Let's go. You attack me, get popped. Like, simple as that. Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> he got destroyed, but he's salty as fuck. Like, that's what you get for being rude. Double equipping and doing all that shit. Like, nah, just boost. Get pop. So, what's up? What's up, Josh? <laughs> oh, shit. Should have sent that to a guy for a level 4. Rank 4. GG. Yep. You want to go ahead and quit? Yep. Mmm. Boost. Boost. <laughs> it's like fucking, uh, oh my god. It's a high school DXD with this shit. It's, oh my god. So, so powerful. <laughs> Alright, I'll continue talking and let me get another duel. I'll be right back. So, he messed up Pendulum Rising, I think I've only played that card once. It was, I, I we wanted to try on these when I was running like Triple Lamia and, and Triple uh, uh, Slime, Necro Slime. I was like, alright, well I can just go ahead and, you know, get rid of them and uh, and get a same summon to Kepler. So, uh, I, I knew of the card, you know, a lot of people didn't know of the card. It, it seemed like it did a pretty good in the event, you know, get rid of level 4, special summon, sorcerer, pop 2, get to search, awesome. And, uh, yeah, and one more big, 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 big cheat. But, uh... Just a lot, a lot of, even intentional and unintentional, cheating is cheating, especially in this game, it really is. Cheating is cheating. And that man seemed like he was cheating. So, uh, let's go ahead and start off with the normal summons. Uh, I don't know what was in, what was going through his head when he was getting them additional normal summons. I mean, it's not like, it's not like your opponent, uh, like, it's not like you, you haven't normal summoned recently, you know? You're like, summon our again and I got hit with a solemn. And then proceed to try to normal summon, I think, like, Ignister later, like, in later in turn. Like, there's no way that you get hit by a solemn and strike or warning. I can't remember which one it was, but it doesn't matter. Because it, it's Armageddon Knight. Either was it strike on summon or warning. It doesn't matter. That was his normal summon. Uh, he committed to the play, got hit with the, with the with the solemn. There's no way you forget that in the same turn. Like, if it turns a couple turns away, sure, but, you know. So, we are going against the ghost tricks, apparently, so go ahead and flip me back, flip me down, sure, that's fine, you can have that, what that's not even that, I, I just don't really like ghost tricks because they're so damn stally, like, maybe he'll play it like freaking Stanzi does, but, you know, I'm, I'm not a big fan of this deck, you guys know that, you guys know that, so, once you control, can I attack several ghost trick monsters, once you cannot attack face on position monsters, direct attack, at the big damage, if that if a monster plus damage change that monster to the emphasis in some museum. Okay, and what you search for? Search for a lantern, of course we did. Of course we did, so that should be fun. And by fun I might just go into like Utopia the Lightning when I build up more resources and just fuck with you. So we'll just go ahead and set the strikes and warnings and just play this duel as slowly as possible. It's ghost straight, so you have to play it methodically. A really methodical deck to duel against. You gotta keep track of your resources, their resources. They only have so many blocks, but you gotta just keep that in mind. And the, their course are back row, like panic, like ah, he panicked real quick too. He panicked as soon as he saw my monster. He panicked, so it's fine. I have a 19 booty, so let's go. But uh, yeah. So try to get that additional normal summon on a. Uh, what does Ghoul do? Is Ghoul the one that mills on top of my deck or something like that? Once turn, you can target one ghost trick monster. Secure. You control the attack comes equal to the combined attack of all ghost trick monsters. Okay, so I guess you're just gonna attack me directly, or maybe you're gonna actually exceed. No, you're actually gonna exceed. All right, who are you going into? Uh, who's level three? Alucard, I guess. Yeah, I guess Alucard. If I fuck him up with solemn warning or strike, I think he still gets the sect though. 
Alright, so let me go ahead and read you. If this card is sent to a grab, period, yeah, he could target one of you. So he's, he's already going to pop one of my set cards, so I might as well just hit him with, with, the, with the goodness, right? So you can just go ahead and catch the solemn notice and go ahead and sit down out card. I don't care if you get your effect in the graveyard, I really don't. They say this card, this card is sent to grab, yeah, period, so. You were sent to grab, period, not even like this card in the field. Just sent to grab, period, so you can go ahead and get your ghoul back. So I know two out of the four cards in your hand right now. I already committed to your normal summon, so that's good. Really, I'm okay for right now. This hack can only special summon Raid Raptor Monsters by using this effect. The charm special summon this card hand and to go ahead and search. You have special summon monsters during the turn you have to do this effect except for Raid Raptor Monsters. Okay. That's fine. So I guess I'll go ahead and flip you up. Then once per turn during your main phase, this card was normal summon special summon this turn, increase all levels. But during your main phase, this card was sent to a graveyard. This turn, you can banish this card from graveyard, add one rib after card. Okay. Well, I guess I can go ahead and just normal summon uh, Impale. I'm probably not going to use him. Or or Fuzzy. I mean, it really doesn't matter. Just normal summon. Uh, go into Utopia the Light. No, no, because I'm going to detach you. So I guess I'll just go with Impale. Go into Utopia the Lightning and detach, you know. Uh, detach him, go up to 5,000, hit you directly, and then get my search during main phase too. Yeah, yeah. If you control the blah, blah blah blah, you cannot special summon monsters during the turn. You have to use any of these effects except for raid after monsters. So I'm assuming I can't activate his effect if I uh, uh, his effect if I do Utopia and Utopia Lightning in main phase one, and then max do his plays in main phase two. I don't think I can do that, but I guess we'll find out. Oh, Utopia, Utopia the Lightning. I guess I will detach just because I want to get my shit in the graveyard and proceed to fuck him up because uh, ghost tricks are super weak to Utopia the Lightning. Like, like it's, just, it's just sad that you could just bust out a rank 4 so easily and fuck up ghost tricks who like to block so much with Utopia Lightning. It really does suck. It's like an Amadeus with ease. Anyway. Uh, you know, and you try to get, you know, and they were big normal summons, like, you normal summon again, like, of course, send your Zephyrus and do that play, because you're running some kind of, like, dark, uh, uh, Draco Pow deck, sure, alright, so, then you try to, you know, normal summon Luster when you already normal summon, and try to do that shenanigans and make it Mister on your opponent, which, of course, your opponent pointed out, yeah, you already normal summon. Oh, it's only when I attack a monster that I can boost. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. Should have realized that, but we're still good. We're still good, so... Uh, it says other than fuzzy. Okay. Well, maybe I'll just go ahead and summon normal summon boost, special summon you, go into such tricks, detach you, search, and then search for like maybe another mega boost or something. So, uh, it's like what? Swords of Concealing Light or something like that? Like, nah, maybe he's going on the defensive. Maybe he'll go ahead and play Panic, or another Panic. I'm not sure. So, yeah, and then I think in the other duel. So, wait, you get rid of Museum and play House now? So, I must attack directly and all damage is inflicted is halved. Okay. So, instead of Museum, we're going in the House. So, probably better in this situation because I can't attack his monsters. So, he can possibly build up monsters, resources, take it slow. But he's going to be taking these direct attacks, though. Like, that's not going to be good. You don't want to take these direct attacks. You don't want to catch these hands. And I got my first attack. Like, let's go. So, we'll go ahead and normal summon boost. I just summon Fuzzy, because I'm, I'm planning on going for Strix anyway, so I'm totally fine. So activate, special summon that Fuzzy. I'm running Necros Attack, I definitely am, it's just, you know, but at least I got background in this duel, so I'm warning, so I'm notice Necros Attack, like, hell yeah, hell yeah. So, I'll go ahead and go into the powerful Force Strix. I don't think that searching for, uh, for, uh, like a boost would be good, just because I seriously doubt he's ever gonna come after me. I'm just not drawing any of my freaking uh, rank up cards. Like, where are my fucking rank up cards? Where are they? We can only use the effect of fuzzy once per turn, right? Yeah. So, uh, not sure what I need. I mean, it's always good to get you. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and get uh, uh, I can't search for. I guess I can't search for. Uh, last tricks because he's level one. So, alright. That's fine. But I guess I'll go ahead and get you then. I really don't need another one. You, but yeah, straight up fuzzy. After your fact, gave me my last fuzzy. A Decker's attack. I guess I'll be attacking you directly for freaking uh, uh, 2500 and you're not going to be able to block. So, 
Ah, this duel will be so easy just because of Utopia the Lightning. Makes this duel extremely easy. Oh, never mind. This will be, it's only going to be 12. Uh, 1250 instead. Uh, your, yeah, your mansion. Yep. Switching off a mansion instead of museum was definitely a good choice. Definitely a good choice, though. So you can just take it slow, build up resources. Just, you can't drop your things. You know, you can't drop your lantern and all that shit with lightning coming after you. So you need to get rid of lightning as soon as possible. Like, ASAP. I'm just worried about you sitting me down, you know, playing like sorts of concealing light soon or something, or at least I don't have to worry about, uh, rippling, not rippling mirror force, uh, I forgot what it's called, it's like quaking mirror force or something like that, at least I don't have to worry about that, but yeah, uh, his other additional normal summon, I believe he like summoned donkey, used his, pen his pendulum rising, which is fine, and, uh, summoned sorcerer, pox, whatever, search for, uh, skull curve by joker, and then tried to get another normal summon on that, like, no, no, and, you know, these are like later in duels. Like I know you play tested your deck. There's no way, and it just seems like it doesn't seem like a mistake. Like maybe fool you once, shame on you, fool you twice, yeah, you know. But you're doing this, you know, constantly. It seems like you're intentionally like, hey, if I get away with it, then awesome, you know. And I, I really don't like that. That's what it seemed like he was trying to do. Really didn't like that. Uh, so you normal summon her. Uh, what do you do? Uh, once per turn, you can target one face-up monster and change the defense, space down defense position. Uh, no, she's fine, but on the summon, I'm gonna go ahead and hit you there, because attack, pop you, pop you. So get rid of that, pop you, pop you. Definitely don't need it. Like, I'm in control of this duel. <laughs> yep, yep, scoop it out. Alright, I'll go ahead and get one more duel, and I'll finish talking. Bear back. So yeah, just 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 plays that I, I'm just not not the biggest fan of. Yeah, you know how I feel. If we can go ahead and uh, draw. Oh wow, I did not open up good. <laughs> I didn't open up well at all. Uh, what's your stats? Terrible. Maybe I can hold off. I'm gonna go ahead and set. I don't want to reveal my deck, so I'm gonna set you. Set the solemn warning. Set the Icarus attack. Hopefully you don't get twin twister. Hold him, hold him off so he doesn't kill a monster with solemn strike. Flip up XC. Like I did not open up well. <laughs> yeah. Like, of course, singing. Not not fluff, singing. With, I had to control it too much. I only run one singing during it. Like, god damn it. <laughs> That's not what I needed. Hopefully, I don't have to use a attack. Like, I'm just crossing my fingers and praying for not Twin Twister. Like, I love Twin Twister, and then I, I can hate it at the same time. At least it's not Harper's Feather Duster or Heavy Storm. Like, I, I, I can at least go with that. Uh, no. One, I don't want you to kill me. And two, I don't want you to get any traps. As simple as that. So, no. Now watch, just watch. Institution, let's go. Institution order. I stopped your normal summon, but let's see if you got another play. Oh, that's foolish. Then, oh, Shadow Mist. Okay, so it's like a hero dank wall deck. Add a hero monsters. Diamond dude. Okay. I don't want to have to use the Icarus attack, but maybe I might have to. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm just okay for right now. I'm okay. Like, if he tries to hit me with any kind of background, I got the Icarus attack, so... I got another Solemn Strike, like the power. Let's go. So, Flip Summon, my my Lanius response. I'm kind of hoping that you wait to hit me with back row until I get my, uh, my, uh, my strips. That would be great. So he's like, he's obviously going to exceed. I'm like, yes, I am. Frontal Tribute. That sucks. That's the last card I wanted to see. I was really hoping to go into XC, so... That sucks. I got nothing right now, too. Uh, yeah. Gotta use Icarus Attack, but I don't think it's worth it right now. That sucks. Why Torrental Tribute? I, was, I would even be fine with Solemn Warning, fucking Bottomless, whatever, but not Torrental Tribute. Like, god damn it. Uh, that's not what I needed. Not at all. Still have my Icarus attacks, so I'm still okay. And the other one was just a bluff e-call, like, alright. Give me Stratos, Stratos, I need to search! Fucking triple e-calls and shadow mints and all them shenanigans. Like, you have enough search in this goddamn deck, like, hell no. Hell no. Send him that diamond dude, that's fine. Diamond dude effect, that's fine. No. <laughs> Give me for 14, that's fine. Like, now, now I'm low on resources, and that's not something you should generally see with this deck. 
Like, I need another fucking impale. Like, if I can get another impale, let's go. No, now I get fuzzy. Like, god damn it. Should've just took it slow. I really should've. Should've just took it slow. At least you're stronger than Diamond, dude. Oh. And I, like, get used out of my Icarus attack, but god damn it. <laughs> ah, but... Oh, now it's fucking Galaxy Cyclone. Now it's Galaxy Cyclone. God damn it! How does he keep on getting everything and I can't get shit? <laughs> it's fine. No. <laughs> so you're just gonna come after me or actually you're gonna commit to like a normal summon and do all in place? Like, uh Monk. That's fine. Hey Koss? Please, for the love of God, let me, there's so many Raid Raptor monsters. Let me just draw into a Raid Raptor monster. That's all I need. So let me draw into a Raid Raptor monster. Any Raid Raptor monster. Almost any Raid Raptor monster. I try to draw into like last or something. Like, oh my God. All I need to do is just summon. So you have Bubble Man in your hand. You have Shadow Man. So I know you. I know all your plays. Let me draw into level four. Yes. 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 That's exactly what I needed. Exactly what I fucking needed. I, I, could, I couldn't ask for a better. I literally, I probably couldn't even ask for a better fucking. Uh, Raid Raptor. So go ahead and send Mimicry, Banish Mimicry, search, and start building up my resources again. Like, I know all your plays now. Ah, uh, oh, yes. Yes, 80. So go ahead and play my Nest, activate my Nest. The only thing I'm really afraid of right now is just getting fucking just wrecked by Castell. Because he can, of course, just summon, special summon, make a Castell, and then spin me away. And my fucking Strafe Soul would get no use. That would suck. That would, that would really suck. So kind of worried about that. Uh, so I should kind of count, prepare to counter him. So I can go ahead and search for Vanishing. I guess I should just tackle you first before Xing into my, uh, my, uh, my Force Tricks, of course. So, uh, yeah, just big normal summons. Uh, not popping his, uh, his, uh, Sorcerer during the end phase with Pendulum Rising. That's kind of, eh, you know, uh, I can see how he can understand, but he's playing the card. Like, no one else knows it. So, that's it. And it, it's, it's everyone, it's your job to make sure that the game state is correct. It really is. So, I'm kind of, eh, on that one. Like, maybe, I'm not sure if it affected the game state or how the duel went down too much, but yeah, I could definitely see him, you know, getting slapped on the wrist for that one. I could search for boost. I really could if he kind of gets greedy and thinks he can just kill me off. I kind of want him to kill me off, I just don't want to get cast out. Like that, that would be bad. That would be bad, so I think I might get boost. So I'm going to go ahead and boost, and Fuzzy will go off. So, just building up resources again. I would love to get off Soul Shave, it's just I gotta, I gotta have you in the graveyard, so I'm not sure if you're gonna ever end up in the graveyard, is the question. So he's drawing into a new card that I don't know of. He has Bubble Mans and uh, Sediment, so I'm assuming if he, if he can, set the card. Oh no, he's just gonna play Galaxy Cyclone, that's fine. Uh, set the card that he drew if it's a back or something. I mean, oh, Hero Lives, never mind. He's just gonna fucking just a Hero Lives me, let's go. Yep, <laughs> let's go. Top deck into that Hero Lives. It's like he top decked in that fucking Galaxy Cyclone, like, this duel is annoying. Top deck into that Torrental, like, this duel is annoying. At least I, you know what, at least I have fucking, uh, boost. So as soon as he goes into fucking Dank Wall or something, I can just go ahead and get boost, pop you. Because I know you're gonna go into Dank Wall, yep. So, you couldn't wait, couldn't wait, so no search for you. Couldn't wait, let's go. Denkwa? Or Anki. No, Anki, you're greedy, man, you're greedy. You're like, I wanna get it in. He's like, I'm going for fucking game right here, right now. So some go, man. Oh, never mind, never mind. Make a Castell spin me away, tap, tap, game. Yep, 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 yep. He got everything. Everything, every single one of his resources. Wow. That too? Nigga, so greedy. So greedy. <laughs> Attack me with Ankh. I'll go ahead and boost. You should. All you had to do was Castell. All you had to do was Castell. All you had to fucking do was Castell. Now you lose. All you had to do was Castell, nigga. Oh my god. All you had to do was Castell. All you had to do was Castell. That's all you fucking had to do. Just summon, summon, Castell, spin, tap, tap, game. But no, no, I want to get in. I want to go in. I want to go balls deep. So you misplayed. Sorry. Uh, uh, Kuji, Kuj, Kujibo, I guess. But yeah, you misplayed. Uh, that's the last duel. That's the last duel uh, for this right here. Uh, let me finish talking. And then 
probably the biggest cheat of all, the biggest cheat of all, and there's one that's just like, absolutely no. Uh, he went ahead and, uh, you know, did his plays. Pendulum summoned Sorcerer, did whatever. Normal summoned, um, that, uh, X-Saber guy, Polymer, I think. Went into Beast. When he went into Beast, his Pendulum Sorcerer, who was supposed to go back to extra deck, he put it in the graveyard. And you're like, wow, that, I mean, I mean, it's in the graveyard. I mean, wouldn't you rather have it in the extra deck? That's not bad. No. He then proceeds to go Insta-Fusion, summon Norton, Norton summoned back the Sorcerer that shouldn't have been in there, and it made it in, into a, uh, Raphalesia. Yeah. Yeah. He's fucking busted. Like, uh, yeah. no. And, uh, and uh, keep in mind, this is the first place winner. This is the YCS winner. All these cheats, all of them, just from this one guy. Not including all, probably all the cheats. On, caught on video, you know, red, he's caught here handed. So, a lot of people are discussing, was it intentional, was it unintentional, you know, what how should be reprimanded. Uh, it doesn't matter, Konami has a policy. Whether it's uh, unintentional or intentional, you cheated. You, you affected the game state, and in the end, won duels off of cheating. You know, whether it be intentional or not, really. So, uh, if I was Konami, I'd recommend the same way. You didn't win the YCS, uh, send back all your prizes. I would, I would probably say, uh, unless you can you catch other people, uh, any else cheating, I'd move everybody else up a rink. So, I think in the finals, that Cosmo guy who got second place, he gets first place. You get, you know, he's disqualified. Like, he's out. Like, he doesn't drop down to second rate. He's out. You know, uh, Er, I think his name was, or if I'm pronouncing it right, you're disqualified. You're out. Everybody moves up a rank, so, you know, second place, you get first and all that. And, uh, Er, and like I said, cheating isn't cheating, intentional or not, so, uh, I say ban for three years. Yeah, yep, yeah. yeah. especially that big one, that big one. Like, normal summons, eh, you know, the Pendulum Rising, eh, but the fucking summon Pendulum Sorcerer back from the graveyard that wasn't supposed to be in the first place, like, yeah, yeah. So, three years ban, we'll see you in 2019. I, I mean, it's policy, it's policy. Some people are like, was it intentional, was it unintentional, doesn't matter, should he get the fool? Doesn't matter, it's a policy. It's just the rules, rule baby, so, guess, yeah. So, that's what I think about cheating. Intentional or unintentional, it's it's your job to make sure everything goes right. And the judges were there, I don't know what the fuck they were doing, like, you, they were clearly watching and they didn't catch any of that shit. It's just, mm. So, anyway, tell me what you guys think about the cheating that uh, Urk got caught in the first place winner of YCS Prague. Uh, just, I should have lost this duel, I really should have, but man got the tits. He had everything, every single one of his cards was useful to him, and he, he had the tits, he should have beat me, but he got greedy, ran into that boost, that powerful boost, glad I put him in here. I was thinking, until that Pierce boost, he's probably going to send a cast down me, but hey, maybe not, maybe he'll get, you know, greedy, I think he maybe he's going to go like a Blade Armor Ninja or something. And that's exactly what he did, ran into that, and got wrecked. Like, mm. Yep, and next turn, I could have just went Shell Save first, short, uh, Soul Shave Force, paid half my life points to summon back Strix, go into Infinity, eat that, and just win. Winning. Good, <laughs> you know, winning. Yep, summon you, summon you, go into like Utopia Lightning, tack, crit, tack, tack game. So I would've won. But he messed up, he messed up. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. I'll of course be back tomorrow, uh, tagging, using them, um, Princess Plants. I changed it up a bit, so, uh, doing some synchroing, so hopefully we'll do that. But, uh, yeah, hope that you find this video entertaining, and yeah, see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.